The human genome has been completely mapped by scientists for the first time ever. That in a report at Study Finds. Be sure to like and subscribe below. After more than 20 years, scientists have successfully mapped the complete human genome. Researchers say it contains over 6 billion letters of DNA. That's more letters than McDonald's sold in burgers so far this year. A stack that would reach at least 8 feet tall. <laughs> yeah, I kid. It's a joke. It's a joke. Knowing every inch of the human genome opens the door to exploring all aspects of human development which genetics determine. Shedding new light on diseases, intelligence, and even physical appearance. <laughs> Wait a minute. You want three legs? We got that. You want eyes on the back of your head? No problem. Special orders don't upset us. <laughs> Seriously, though, that's not what we're talking about here. Genes control everything from eye and hair color to height to the size of your nose. The breakthrough is... What about my nose? The breakthrough is a Rosetta Stone for understanding complex mutations, underlying illness, and evolution. In 2003, scientists published a revised draft, which was still missing more than 8% of the genome. The hard-to-sequence long stretches were most complex, full of repeating letters. They were impossible to decipher with the technology at the time. Now an international team has. Lead author Dr. Adam Filippi from the University of Maryland said, quote, In the future, when someone has their genome sequenced, we will be able to identify all of the variants in their DNA and use that information to better guide their health care. He said getting this done was like putting on a new pair of glasses. We are lost, but now are found. Blind, but now we see. The clouds have parted and the rain has stopped. Sorry, <laughs> I get kind of into this. It's exciting. The co-author, Professor Evan Eichler, said that the complete blueprint is going to revolutionize the way the scientific community thinks about human genomic variation, disease, and evolution. The Human Genome Project has taken more than two decades to reach this point and cost $3 billion. The 6 billion letters of DNA are spread among 23 pairs of chromosomes. To read a genome, scientists first chop up all that DNA into pieces, hundreds to thousands of letters long. Most cells contain two genomes, one for the father and one for the mother. Other key advances include rapid improvements in Oxford University's gene sequencing machines, that can accurately read a million letters of DNA at a time. Complex gene patterns may have helped create the human species and explain our rapid evolution. Some associated with bigger brains are highly variable. Professor Eichler notes one person might have 10 copies of a particular gene, while others may only have one or two. <laughs> Guilty. This can spell trouble during fertilization. When chromosomes from mom and dad line up and swap pieces, the mismatched genes can lead to an earthquake of alterations. We have tons more info on this and other studies. Just click on the link in the description below and head to studyfinds.com.